Hey guys, I did here, and today I have a tutorial on the Black Dragon Smart Egg. Go ahead and click on either egg in the basket for its corresponding tutorial. This tutorial is on the hardest of the three two-layered eggs, the black one. So this method I came up with on my own. I haven't seen any videos, didn't get any help from anybody. Uh, I'm not sure if it's the legitimate way to do it, but I'm going to go ahead and show you guys the way I do it. So, just like in the red and the blue, start with it like this. It's going to be a little bit harder because it's a black egg and I, a lot, I really would like to show you what it's like looking through these, but it's kind of difficult. But anyways, you put this down, then you turn the bottom clockwise with your ring finger, then bring it straight down. Then uh, while keeping it closed, I'm going to turn it even more clockwise and then angle it down and push it all the way through. I'm not going to pull it up, I'm going to pull it back a little bit and then I'm going to push this up and then push this against this wall. Now the ball should be right there but I'm going to pull this down, pull this out and then push it back up. Then this part I would really like to show you inside. I'm going to pull it, I'm, going to, no, I'm not going to push it through, I'm going to pull it back out of the little opening, so I'm pulling it back all the way. Then I'm going to turn this clockwise. And if you're looking inside of here, you're actually moving, it's like a whole nother part of the egg. And then I'm gonna push it through, just barely, so that when I pull this down, it pulls it down with it. Then I'm gonna push it in all the way. I push it in against the wall, then I'm going to turn this clockwise, bring this down like that, and then bring this out, and then pull this down, and then push it through, and then bring it up, and then bring it around and bring it through. Then bring it back around, push it against the wall, close that, bring it toward you, pull it down, push it through, angle it as high as it can go, push it against the wall, pull it, pull it toward you, so pull this out, then push it in, go ahead and push it through, not all the way, pull this down, pull this up, close it, then push the wand down into the egg, pull this down, then pull this wand straight toward you, and then push the bottom half up, move it around, push it through, move it around, and before pushing it through, I'm going to turn this clockwise once, or as far as it can go, and then push it through. Then I'm going to move it down, left, through, here, close it, move it back down, then here, and then push it through, and then I'm sort of going to hold it at a weird angle, and I'm going to push it through. I know it can go through. Sometimes it takes a little bit of wiggling around, though. So there, I closed it. What I did is I, I like pulled this that way and then closed it. Then I'm going to just turn this part clockwise as far as it can. Then pull it, pull the wand around, and then pull it toward me. Flip it. Turn this part more clockwise. Once you have it here, after this is turned all the way, you're going to pull this through all the way and you can then push it in pull it out and then kind of push this up so what I did there is I pushed it I pulled it toward me then I pushed this up with the wand in my hand then I'm going to move it around push it through and move it around and then pull it through and then move it here and there you go now this was definitely the more challenging one this is the way I came up with I'm gonna go over it a little bit quicker uh, and then do another example solve like I did with the blue and red alright so once again down move the bottom clockwise move this straight down move the bottom clockwise more angle it down 
push it there, pull it down, uh, push it back, turn this, push it through barely, move this down with it, push it against the wall, turn that that way, and then close it, pull that out, move it down, and then move it up and around through that. Then this whole entire middle part is basically the same thing, just like on the red one. Until you get to this point, when you're at the end of this little thing. Then you turn this clockwise, and then you push it through. And this part, I don't really like it, just want to wiggle it a little bit. Uh, and then push it through. Then I pull this wand through here, and then I move it straight up, move it around here, close it, move it around here, pull it, move it here, and then there you go. Alright, so there is my tutorial for the Black Dragon Smart Egg. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments below. I know this one was a bit tricky to follow, but it is a bit tricky itself. It's definitely the harder of the three. Again, the blue is the beginner, the red is the medium, and the black is the, I guess, expert, you could call it. This did take maybe hours of just trying to, like, fiddle around with it. I finally got it today after recording this tutorials for the other two. But anyways... The cubicle.us will have them on their store for $20 each, as well as the six small one layer egg. Once again, if you want to get to the blue or red tutorial, just click on the egg in the basket for that corresponding tutorial. I hope this tutorial helped you guys out. Uh, if there's anything wrong with this tutorial, then I will be sure to delete it right away. If you get confused, just go back and watch it multiple times. It does take a little bit of getting used to. So that's it for this tutorial. If you have any questions, please feel free to let me know in the comments below. Don't forget to like this video if you liked it. This video's question is, are you guys going to be getting your own smart eggs? I hope you all enjoyed, and thanks for watching.